just got to the Soul Forest and it's so pretty. I love it. Alright, so we've been walking for a little bit and we are trying to find the deer coral. It says it is pretty much a place with deer and I am very, very excited for that. There they are. Oh, they're so cute. Right, so one of the best parts about Korea is like this. I love this so much. It's just amazing this is so nice for hot weather they would just like i want this in denmark but it will never happen like the size like it's filled to the brim and you get so much ice and the ice lasts forever well if you're curious i just got like basic black americana because i hate when there's like sweetener in coffee and then i add like a bit of milk once i've drank a bit of it how can i show this without spilling there you go So much coffee too. I was scared it was gonna overfill, but it does not overfill. I'd probably stop there, but since I want all the coffee, I feel like you could do this by buying just one, only pouring half of it in. It tastes really good. Uh, what it is? Coffee. Hmm. Ah, I love it so much. And of course, this wouldn't be a lit in Olivia video without buying something from Olive Young. I don't even know what I got. Oh my god, yeah. I've been wanting to get into like hair care in general. So I got this serum which apparently is like really good, like an oil. Cause my, I don't know what's happening. My hair feels disgusting. It doesn't feel disgusting right now cause I washed it today. So it has nice bones and curls and I was like, I didn't understand why my curls did look very defined and I think that's because I don't have enough moisture in my hair, so we're gonna try this out. And I I only really just bought two, two of these because apparently it's like a dupe for the beauty your sun, sunscreen, the rice one, and the, I already tried it and you get like two in here for like 16 Korean won, so super duper cheap. And then my mom got like mists which is nice.
so I was in the Koyak mall and I tried to find like a bookstore and they did have something they actually picked I actually picked up two books and yeah they didn't have much English options so I went to this one and it's called Kyo Kyopo and I'm gonna see what we can find here I'm mostly interested in like actual Korean books by Korean authors and nothing else so let's see what we can find This is my little stack I have chosen. They didn't have the one I wanted, but that's okay. I mean, I want all of these, but yeah. All Korean authors. Which is what I wanted. I swear to God, I am such a bad vlogger. I need to vlog more. I'm really happy with my outfit. It's really fucking cool. As you can tell, I love it. But we're gonna go to Myeongdong, which I'm so excited for. See how that goes. I think we found the stream. Yeah, I think we found the stream that we we're looking for. It looks already so cool. It's so loud, though. So I forgot to vlog yesterday, but we're basically going to go to this market that I forgot the name of. I'll try and have it on the screen now, uh, and I'll try and vlog the food we get. We didn't end up getting like market food. We literally got like basic bitch Western food because yeah, it's it's really fun. We're going to go to the market, and I really wanted to go to this huge accessory store that's called New New, I think. And there are two in Korea, and it's open from like 11 a.m. to like 5 a.m. on weekdays. And on weekends, it's from 7.30 till 5 a.m. So that's insane, so I'm very excited for that. And then we're planning on getting Korean barbecue for dinner, which I love, and I'm very excited.
går vi lige om på den anden side. Nu skal du anden side. Er det tilbage her? Ja. Gør mm, op. That was worth wait. Hej, det så godt. Mm. Kiwi and strawberry. Delicious. It's okay. Mm -hmm. On the fishy side. Oh, it's fishy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that food was absolutely yeah. delicious. I love the dumplings. And I loved the noodles, but they were like hand caught and they were so thick and they were just so good. I love this so much, but I could not finish it because it was, oh, it was amazing. I feel bad not being able to eat all of it. I almost ate all of it, but not all, all, all of it. I'm really happy with how it felt. So now I'm going to go to that accessory store, which I'm very excited for. I want a full tummy. Alright, so me and my mom is gonna go to this really pretty plant cafe that I thought was super pretty. I think it's vegan, which is super interesting. And I wanted to go there since I saw it on my run. All right, so I forgot to tell you guys, but we went to the Bokansang Forest. It's like an hour away from Seoul, and we're here right now. You can see from the background, and also. But we're a bit unsure, but we're gonna try to check it out. Alright, so if you want to go somewhere quiet in Korea, go here. I know there's a ton of other places, but like we're the only people here and it's so chill and calming and I've been dealing with so many issues with like if like being too loud and too many people, so I really enjoy this area because it's very quiet, it's only like an hour away from like Seoul and yeah, there's not many people here and it's just lovely. I highly recommend if you want something a bit more quiet, I suppose.
If you're like a nature lover, you have to go and see this place. It is so freaking pretty and it smells amazing and it's so much more like relaxing in comparison to being in Seoul the entire time because I feel like when you were in Seoul it was like just too much too many people too much simulation and just like being too overwhelmed like look at this I love it like I love that I love visiting any form of nature places when I go on vacation regardless of where it is So my hair is different, as we can see, I just showered. I was meant to record an outro in the Korea vlogs while I was in Korea, but if you saw my first vlog, I did kind of talk about the fact that I was extremely tired 24 seven. And I don't know why, I was just dealing with this constant jet lag almost and it was just really bothersome to me. So here is the outro. I really really enjoyed my trip to Korea and I would 100% go again. For multiple different reasons, I love how cheap everything was, I love the culture, I am obsessed with Korean skincare. There's just so many things I love about Korea and just like Asian countries in general, like I also love Japan and like countries like that. Not saying I wouldn't go to other Asian countries, just like I love those two and I would go multiple times. Like if Korea wasn't on the other side of the planet, I would probably go multiple times a year if it wasn't expensive. You get what I'm saying? Like it's actually something I would go to maybe just stock up on my skincare just because I would literally be saving money in the long run. But yeah, as I was saying, I don't know what I was dealing with. I was just really, really tired. So I'm really happy with how the vlog turned out. Don't get me wrong, I'm really happy with it. But I definitely think it could be better. This is my first like official vlog. Besides my me trying like 10 healthy habits for a week, or then it was five, I don't remember. But yeah, I really, really, really hope you enjoyed that video. And if you did, maybe you wanna like the video, comment down below what you thought of the video. And if you like to see more of my content, maybe you wanna subscribe to the channel as well. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day, night, evening, wherever you are in the world, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.